Hey everyone, it's Mindy from the OG Sports Network. Excited to bring you nine Major League Baseball plays here for today, August 5th on a Monday. Hopefully you guys have had a good start to your week thus far. But it will get even better tonight once we get some baseball going. All right, if you guys are not familiar with how this works, I have a baseball model. I then compare that to Vegas opening lines. Then I see how my variance matches with wins and losses over the season. We track everything, all 5,000 plays here so far this season. And then we can see how frequently we hit in these certain buckets, certain buckets, right? So it's my variance versus Vegas's model. And all we try to do is find the edges where we can find some wins. And that's what we bring to you here every day. All right, let's get started to it with it. Let's go ahead and add it to the stage here. Let's get going. All right. Play number one is going to be between the Mets here and the Cardinals. We have Manaya on the mound, 3.03 ERA over his last five, 3.5 overall, so has been steady. Puente on the mound, 4.15 ERA over his last five, 404 this season, also steady. The Cardinals offense right now swinging the bats pretty well. They're also averaging 12.8% more than the Mets on that offensive impact that I like to talk about, right? Batting average, run scores, all of those offensive categories, the Cardinals are actually doing better. So what we're going to do is even though we have the model with the Mets winning this one four to three, we're going to go ahead and take this Cardinals team on the run line. It is the better play. We're taking them at 61.4% of the time. They will be victorious in this spot. All right, let's take it. Next up is our VIP play of the day. This is our very best one statistically in the model. In order to get this, you just need to go to our multi-capper site. It's ogcappers.com. You can find us under the OG Cappers VIP section on that all cappers tab. You can then go ahead and take a look at our best bet here on the board. This one coming in at 74.5%. You can also check out all of our other hot cappers with their hot plays and you can see who's doing what, right? It's all there documented straight there for you. And also make sure you guys go ahead and pick up one of our pick packages today, right? You can go ahead and use this promo code OG20 to save you 20% off at checkout. Also, our pick packages are profit guaranteed, meaning that if our cappers don't turn a profit, you get credits back to your account. So it's a win-win situation everywhere. So if you want this play, go ahead and get over there now. Next up is the game, the Reds versus the Marlins. Martinez on the mound, 1.26 ERA over his last five, way better than his overall 3.65 here this season. Munoz on the mound has a 4.5. Five ERA, staying steady with that. The Marlins offense right now, you know, they got it done versus the Braves yesterday, but still that on-base slugging is still low, 622. We're going to go ahead and go on the Reds here on the money line after that big victory they had yesterday with the Yams. Uh, but we're confidence factor here is 53.1% of the time. The Reds will win this one. We have them victorious 4-3 to three today. All right, the Giants and the Nationals. Logan Webb on the mound, 4.5 over his last three, 3.49 this season. Corbin, 7.71, definitely elevated over the last five, over his ERA of 5.88 this season. We're going to go ahead and take a look at this Nationals team. Their bullpen, they've been pretty crappy, right? 4.875. Their offense is doing pretty well, 4.5% higher than usual. Giants offense, so keep showing up here in a big way. They're on base and slugging right now, 8.05. Let's go ahead and get this one over the total. We see we have it coming in at 11 at that 9.5 start. Let's take the over total coming in at 61.8. All right, next up is our text play of the day. Between the Texas teams here, we have Houston and the Rangers. Uh, we have Hunter Brown on the mound versus Andrew Heaney. All you got to do to get this play is text us, right? Text the word WIN to 223-203-1821, and we'll put a winner in your, in your back pocket there every day. This one is our second highest confidence play of the day. 74.4% of the time, we can predict this a winner. Go ahead and shoot me over a text now. All right. Twins and Cubs. Festa on the mound. 2.86 over his last three. Getting it done. Way better than that 6.88. He's looking to bring that down. And then, of course, we have Hendricks. He's still elevated overall this season, but been better than that 6.86 this season at 
two five. The Cubs bullpen right now. They're getting it done, you guys. 1.53 runs less than the Twins bullpen. Cubs, again, are coming off a big showing. We have this one, a statistical tie. So we're going to go ahead and take the Cubs at home on the run line. We'll take the run and a half here, coming in at 61.3%. All right, the Red Sox, my brother's team versus Mindy's team, the Royals. Uh, we're going to go ahead and take a look at Paxton. He has a 5.5 .5 ERA over his last three, 4.52 this season versus Singer. He's been doing well, dealing 2.35 over the last five, 2.88 overall. Been very steady. Plus, you know, you can even ask my brother. He'll tell you this Red Sox bullpen has been uh, not so good. Not so good. Uh, but the bullpen for the Royals, on the other hand, not too shabby. 1.56 runs less than this bullpen for the Sox. Royals offense also capitalizing right now and scoring opportunities, averaging at 5.67 runs over their last three. Let's go ahead and take the Royals here at home at Kaufman on the money line at 65.1% of the time. The Royals here winning six to four. Looks like I have them covering that run line there as well, but the better play money line. Everyone's favorite game of the day, Sox versus Athletics. Cannon on the mound, 3.48, been decent over his 4.11 series. Uh, I guess season 24, season win. Yeah, that ERA, you know what I mean. Uh, versus Sears, 3.7 overall. He's been doing better than the 4.53. Athletics bullpen, they've been better than the White Sox bullpen, 2.11 runs less. The White Sox right offense right now is 10.5% lower than their season average. They're only hitting a 182. I mean, they've been bad, and this Athletics offense has been 4.6% higher, and they're 11.8% better than the White Sox right now. Let's take the A's on the money line here, minus 165. Have them winning 4-3, to three, coming in at 59.2%. And lastly, it's going to be the Phillies and the Dodgers. Should be a good one. It's NOLA, 3.13. He's been steady. 3.43 overall this season. Glass now, again, he's also been steady. 3.75 over his last five. 3.5 over this 2024 season. Dodgers offense, they've been hot, capitalizing on those opportunities, scoring six runs per game. And the Dodgers offense right now, they're scoring 1.67 runs better than the Phillies. Let's take the Angels on, not the Angels, the Dodgers. I saw LA and I said, Dave, oh my goodness, this is terrible. Let's take the Dodgers 67.3% of the time. <laughs> Oh, goodness, you guys. That's all I got for you today. I'll uh, stumble around again for you tomorrow if you'll have me back. Uh, but make sure you check out our other video series. We have Bo out there. We have Solo getting it done. Those two have been crushing it at OGCappers.com. So make sure you get one of their pick packages today. You can find those guys over at our YouTube channel on the shorts page. So make sure you check it out and find even more consensus here on the channel. All right, you guys. Hey, have a great day. We'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.